We are the UL Test Bench Project Team, a multidisciplinary senior design team in the Kate Gleason College of Engineering. Our electrical engineering students are Alex Olds, Sarah Limberger, and Chris Reckner. Camila Ramirez is our mechanical engineering student, and Catherine Vogel is our industrial and systems engineering student. We are working with Qualitrol Corporation to update an electrical test bench located at their Fairport location. The electrical test bench that Qualitrol has been using to perform UL compliance testing on manufactured switches has been deemed unsafe for users, but must be used to perform tests at least once every quarter. The original bench has potential to expose users to 440 volts while in use, posing a true hazard to anyone near the bench. The test bench was built nearly 60 years ago and is beginning to wear down, which has decreased the testing capacity by 50%. The original setup is not very easy to use and requires significant user manipulation while carrying out the test procedures. Additionally, the original electrical layout leaves potential for catastrophic failure due to poor planning. The main goal of this project is to first protect the user or anyone who may be near the bench from dangerous electricity. Next, the bench must perform all tests required for UL compliance. Lastly, the team aims to increase the efficiency of the testing process by minimizing the amount of time the user needs to interact with the system, as well as increasing the testing capacity. The prototype has been designed to minimize mechanical parts in order to simplify the user system interaction. Parts that are no longer needed or were worn down were either removed, replaced, or repaired to fit the new system. The layout of the worktop was simplified and wiring was reorganized to make repairs and troubleshooting easier. Safety interlocks were installed on the worktop lid and cabinet doors to ensure the system turns off when parts are exposed. An emergency stop button was incorporated to allow for safe user control of the high voltage system. The test bench is still in the process of being assembled and it aims to be fully functional. We would like to extend a thank you to our sponsors, Qualtro Corporation and Fortive Corporation for funding our project. Thank you to Andre Pelletra at Qualtro for all of his help with the project, as well as the students in the 3D print construct for their assistance.